Hey folks, this is Vagrant. Welcome back to Elden Ring. In the last video, we finally made our way into the southeast and to Kaled. We did the catacombs over there, and then eventually we're going to go explore the rest of it. But for today, we're going to explore Red Main Castle, which is uh, this rather pretty picturesque looking castle in front of me. Now, the teleporter does take me into the middle of the castle, but I figured we'll approach like this uh, how many souls do I have? 44,000, okay. We'll approach like this first, see what happens. And uh, if we can get in like this, we'll get in like this. Is the plan. This makes me very suspicious, however. Long, long runs like that really do make you feel like you're about to get attacked. Why is there another teleporter? feels ominous. <laughs> see night creeping up the castle as I approach. It's fine. Everything's fine. I'll, I'll take the teleporter later. Or will I take it now? Uh, no, no I, I, I want to get into the castle. I mean, it might well take me into the castle like the other one does. I don't know, but... That's for future Vagrant to find out. Tier 3? Tier bloody 3? Because <laughs> I am up there. Oh, I guess I jump off, don't I? Yeah, okay. It doesn't seem like I can climb it, is what I was confused about. I'm going to get rid of my markers. Um, they're just going to annoy me. <laughs> like, I know they're there. It's fine. We'll, we'll just, we, we need to give the whole area a proper explore anyway, so we don't need markers quite yet. Oh, do I have to draw? I have to draw. Ah, it's when I get up there. Right, okay. Need pickups. Why do I only have pickups at the very start of a video? Look at this place. Mad. It makes me really nervous that nothing's tried to murder me yet, you know? I find that very disconcerting. <laughs> the whole place has this, this feeling of just being dead, you know? Of blood and anguish in the edgiest way possible. Well, I'm gonna assume <laughs> this is why you take the teleporter. So what does the other one do? Right, we're gonna, we're gonna take the second teleporter, see what happens, out of sheer curiosity. And then we'll come back and take the first. Unless the second one's better, who knows? Huh? Huh? Alright, I wanna drop down. Oh, that could be a sneaky way in, actually. Let's do this first. Is there anyone here? No. Man, it's so much about the music as well. It's not the music, this that, that, that faint scream constantly in the background, you know? Super weird stuff. Super weird stuff. Freaking Kaled, man. <laughs> I think if I'd come here 20 levels ago, I'd have been terrified. I'm still a little spooked as it is. But I don't have quite that everything can murder me. Then again, I've died a few times already, and that poison rot, if that's a feature of Kaled, and I suspect it is, because it really suits the place, and of course we've already been beset upon... Wait, what? I'd like to mount, please. <laughs> I'm in trouble if you don't let me mount, game. Okay. Alonzi. Didn't know what else to do. <laughs> it is the, yeah, that was, felt like my only alternative. Hey, it's the bats again! Hey, bats. Been a while, buddies. Not since we were climbing the, the wall to the north of the lakes have we dealt with the bats. That's a long time ago now. A long old time ago. Lots of things here are alive. There's at least three enemies, yeah. Oh, you're a bat. I thought it was a dude. <laughs> I'm not sure why in retrospect. Hmm, lots of smoldering butterflies. Interesting. 
Hey, buddy. Oh, no, I never want to kill one of those. Ash of War Flame. Oh, whoa. Oh, let's be careful. <laughs> oh, no. Ash of War Flaming Strike. Another one of those things that I'll never ever use. But one day, I, I'm going to have to do like four or five playthroughs of this game in order to take it all in. Yeah, I didn't think so. That'll be a shortcut later on. Although, it's a shortcut to walk because there's no grace site here. Hmm. I've never done a double playthrough on this channel. I wonder how people would react to a magic user playthrough. Maybe I'd want to wait a while as well. You know, let the game kind of disappear from my mind a little so I feel like I'm discovering things for all over again. I don't know. We'll think about it. It's not going to be immediately. We need to go back onto Halo. <laughs> What I'm looking for... Oh, time for jumping. <laughs> Everyone who plays this game is at least slightly suicidal. Oh yeah, what I'm looking for is where that teleporter was. Or, you know, where I emerged from. What are they? Are they... They're swords and shields. Strung up. And bodies. I'm gonna try to shut up, shut up every now and again just to let the ambiance of the game speak a little bit more. I might it might be a late realization given we are now on episode 38. I want to say, but um, <laughs> it's a realization all the same. I can't shut up for that long, I get a little tetchy. <laughs> when you've been training, I say training as a YouTuber, I haven't been training as a YouTuber, but I have been doing this for 11 years or something like that. What year is it? 2022? I started in 2011. Ten and a half years. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Ten, ten and a half years I've been doing this, and really the main thing you learn as a YouTuber, I suppose, more than anything else, well, I mean, there's definitely a few things, but the, oh, I hate these guys so much. So much do I hate these guys. There we go. Good early hit. But the, the main thing you learn, and the main thing I, I personally notice when I watch like a beginner channel, is that they're terrible at like naturally filling the silence. You know what I mean? Oh, I can't go through there. Like, in a way that doesn't feel forced. I don't talk and force what I'm saying. I talk because... It's become such a natural thing after doing thousands upon thousands upon thousands of videos. God knows how many, maybe 10,000 by this point in time, unironically. I just have to normalize it, really. There's definitely something in here, right? I see you, boys. Boys are everywhere. Oh, a party! <laughs> a boy party! <laughs> the greatest party one can have. To be honest, they didn't. Oh, nice. Oh, interesting. Have a little peek. Anything new there? Maybe the oil pot? I don't necessarily recognize the oil pot. Oh! Uses FP to release acid mist from the mouth. Acid spray mist. Okay, interesting. That's uh, the first perfume I've ever seen. Let's get it. Remember we bought a perfume bottle before? And we dealt with a lot of perfumey kind of stuff a little while ago. Can I open this now? Is this from... This is the door from before, isn't it? Yeah. Okay. I can hear a freaking... I'm very curious about that Marika statue. Wait, maybe it's not. Maybe it's a summer statue. It is a summer statue. Oh. Yeah, it's an interesting location. Was it once a thriving settlement and 
and he just got plagued by the blood rot. So where are we going? More importantly, um... Well, I came from over here. Alright, I climbed up a ladder there, yeah. So another way around? Nope. What's that there? Nothing! Um, right, okay. We'll figure it out, we'll figure it out. Even if I have to go back to the teleporter, we'll figure it out. I need to figure out a way further down. I'm not seeing it quite yet. I'm sure I see it somewhere though. That door in there is very I like it doesn't even say it's locked from the other side or anything. It just it just doesn't let me Ah there we go. I only just saw that. Wait, well maybe not. Went in there. What if I do this? And then this. I'll work, right? I'm not sure this is the intended route, but it's a route all the same. <laughs> I mean, if it works, then it's uh, it's viable, right? Surely. All right, there's two of those. Uh, Pretty spooky wolf boys down here that I need to keep an eye on as well. There's the teleporter over there. I'm not sure how I was meant to get down here. I doubt it was, it was jumping on the statue. That doesn't feel like what the game intended. Maybe you were meant to take the teleporter when I run it. And now what I've done is I've opened up a path, maybe? Anyways. It's funny, the uh, tree. I don't know whether I believe it or not. Do I, do I believe in the guidance of the two fingers and the, the beloved grace of the earth tree? It did deny me entry. Then again, I did join a cult designed to murder it, so... <laughs> Although I don't think that had an impact. I don't know. How do people feel about it? I guess how you feel about it might... might. It's also very suspicious, because it's not saying it's locked from this side or something. I just can't seem to open it for some reason. I see a grey site. Or is it a piece of heather? We'll never know. Well, no, in a minute. It's definitely a great sign. Okay. All right, where are we? Give me a place name. Someone to hang my hat on. My very large hat. Chamber outside the plaza. That is an evocative name you've got there. Okay. Well, before we move into the plaza, I guess that's what that is. We're gonna. Keep on exploring this area over here. Now that I've got the grey site, I feel a bit more comfortable to to fight things and dally around. And there's so few enemies. It's like a ghost town, essentially. I just feel like the rock came and nothing survived, really. You know. Maybe there's some mad old king here holding down the fort, or maybe it's just the beasts now. Speaking of which... I do not like that there's two of those. don't like that at all. But I do want to go explore down there, so... I guess I don't have much choice, really. Remember we fought one of those... Um, in Leonira off the lakes, it was outside, it was resting, and we had to kind of cheese it, if I remember correctly. Why can't I open any of these doors? We had to kind of cheese it at the time, if I remember correctly. We kind of like stood in a doorway and kind of baited it into jumping there repeatedly. Can you come over here so I can get a jump attack on you at least? Yeah, giant black lion, white mane with a sword for an arm. 
come stand on the nice big fancy bodies. Thanks. Well, no time like the present, eh? Alon Z. That didn't work at all. That did not work one iota. I just need to kill one ASAP, right? If I can kill one nice and quick, we'll be okay. Oh, I was so close. I was so fucking close. Oh, come on, man. I didn't pick anything up. What's going on? So, what, what are all these items? Are you the weak one? Nope, you're the strong one. Oh, it died. Maybe that's maybe it died in like a weird place or something. I don't know. I don't know what happened. I was trying to do a play there. Nearly. Ah, right, the other one died. It must have got clipped by his friend. That's why I got the item suddenly. But, like, the most awkward time to suddenly get all these items. Oh, whoa, whoa, you're a tough old slug. Hello. Right, the slugs are always tough, aren't they? Well, we're in reason, you know. I wonder if I can open this from this side. No. I do not have the right. Oh, you don't have the right. But yeah, I mean, you notice how we've seen so few humanoid enemies at the actual castle? Why can't you open it? I mean, you can definitely get in some of these buildings. Because, um... Ah! <laughs> because, um... I've seen items inside of them. I saw a key item in one of them. Come here. Come here. I got two. Nice. Alright, well, I mean, other than my lack of FP, I'm essentially full health, full mana. Well, full health, in a way. I'm, I'm still considering bringing along a single FP flask. I can't decide if that's value or not. I'd have to search for it. That's, that's the building I was before with the, uh, the bandit. But yeah, it's just like, oh wait, this is where I was before as well. Okay, have I explored this area then? Yeah, it looks like it. I feel like I'm locked out of loads of options right now. I don't really know why. Do I need to progress further in this area? Maybe. The problem is that means I'm going to have to come back and kill the bloody lions again, inevitably. But for now, we press on into the plaza. I went this way, right? Yeah. Did I go this way? Uh, yeah. Why am I glowing? Yo, it's Blythe! Hey Blythe! How you doing? It's been a while! Could have helped me with the bloody lions, could you? Alright, big boy. You may not recognize- Hey! Chubby friend! Wait, what? Blythe! Hmm. Thought I might find you here. I must admit. I was a little worried. We missed our meeting. What meeting? But it looks like you're still in one piece, eh? You must have heard by now, right? That Star Skirt Radan holds Rani's fate in stasis. But oh. once or now, oh, whoops. we stand against the demigod once known as the strongest of them all. The way ahead is pleasingly simple. We fight, sword and fang. Into the fray together, eh? <laughs> Let's see what you're made of. Into the freight. <laughs> Hello. Oh, wait. Okay. Bear with me. Do we need to do that? Polite bow. Are these alphabetical? Nope. I'll find it. There it is. Is she here to watch? Is she here to participate? Is that Radon up there? There's a dude there. What's going on? What do we do? Hey. What's over there? Uh. Okay. Now remember. Wait, are you an enemy? I can't target you. Now remember, a while ago. I am over there, I think. 
There was mention of the Great Tournament or something like that. And I think that's where we heard the name of Dawn for the first time. It was something in that area, something about a tournament, something about a fighter's championship, something like that. And we heard that Radon, Radon's the one who left Renala, right? Okay, Rani is the Snow Witch, and she is Renala's daughter. Renala is the Moon Witch, the Lunar Witch, whatever. And Renala and Radon used to be together, and then Radon left? Is it Radon who left? I feel like I'm mixing that name up with someone else, but... Hey. Are you good and prepared, young chum? The festival begins. Oh. Oh. Oh, no. Before we begin, allow me to paint you the full picture. General Radan is cursed ever to wander. Eaten from the inside by Melania's scarlet rot, his wits are long gone. Now he gathers the corpses of former friends and foes alike, gorging on them like a dog. Howling at the sky. But now, we must make merry. Oh, gathering of champions! The revels begin! Alexander! The celebration! Oh. Alright, my bad. Carry on. You will find the field of battle past the church ahead, upon the shore under the fort. General Radan is there, even now, divested of his wits, devouring corpses, and howling at the sky. Dude sounds like a goddamn mess. He ate his horse! His teeny tiny little horse, Alexander! You mentioned this age, this is where we first heard about this. Ah, you came. Hey, How buddy. Delightful. Indeed, I thought I might find you here. By the by, do you know for whom this festival is being held? Is it me? Well, it is none other than General Radan himself. To think, I could face a great champion of the Shattering, a demigod in the flesh. Oh, gosh, in truth. But, oh, whoops. the fear simply assures me the ordeal is worth undertaking. Be sure to get a good vantage, my friend. I, Iron Fist Alexander, do hereby vow to unflinchingly brave this ordeal. You keep trying to jump mid conversation. <laughs> Be sure to get a good eye. Okay, we need to kill Radan so that Alexander doesn't die, <laughs> basically. Into the fray together, eh? <laughs> okay, Alexander, you chill. I'll go first. And you can see what happens. We kind of look similar. We, we'd, be, we'd look good together. All right, went down there. Nothing there. That's where the dude is. Anything down there? Nope. Okay, so it's through the church. First off, don't give up. Okay. Suffering ahead. Are you ready? <laughs> no. What? Is this door open? None of these doors open. Every door is a lie. I'll keep reading the messages. Seems familiar. <laughs> so I'm assuming it means they run every, like, multiple times. Let's grab an item. Yeah. Stupid door. Okay. Oh! 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 Oh, I thought there was that far. <laughs> oh, I thought the barrier was part of the lift there. Okay, we've got a sick America. That's cool. Is this where he is? This is humongous. 
Can I mount? Okay. Is this a mounted boss fight? We've never had a, f a full on mounted demigod boss fight. Yeah? Question mark? Ah! Whoa! 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 Oh, he's got a bow. He's got a freaking bow. Oh, no, I didn't want to do that. Who is this great? Oh! Okay. Um. Look, oh, there's people everywhere. Okay, run. Hide behind the things. Bloody hell. We're done! Stop that. What did I just say? Come here. Alright, I should have brought I should have brought some treats for my horse. <laughs> ah, he's large and scary. Oh, bloody hell. Oh, is he riding on a horse? There's a tiny ass horse. Oh, what's he doing? Redon, don't be a dick. What did I just say, Redon? I said, don't be a dick. What did you immediately go do? Look at him! I'm no wonder Great Horn Tragoff is who? Who is Great Horn Tragoff anyway? Redon, no! A dog, please! <laughs> Look at the tiny little horse! What's going on? <laughs> okay. Well. <laughs> oh no, the poor little horse. Okay, well I didn't mean to try to summon anyone anyway, so I'm glad that we died. It's the only reason I died, obviously, because otherwise I would have, would have one-shot this guy. Of course. Easy. Can I teleport? No. Let's try that again. Okay, but I know to hide behind these things on the way up. Oh, I'm an idiot. Oh, man. That hits you from miles away. Could not for the life of me tell if that was going to protect me. Or oh, how I. Jesus Christ, Radon! <laughs> He's so large. I just ran right towards that. Oh! Oh! Oh, that's a lot of damage. Weirdly enough, it felt like it was going better when I dismounted. <laughs> Maybe, I mean, this is a kind of fight where you kind of want to stay behind him, I guess, and like close to his body. Like, if you're fighting like really big enemies, that tends to be the technique in all of these games. It's like, stand like right behind their leg. Maybe I run up on the horse and dismount one. I, I'll try a dismounted fight. We'll see how it goes. I can't imagine... I mean, look, it's the only fight I've been able to be mounted for, right? That has to be a reason. I'm also very curious about all these um, summons because... There's tons of them. I think it, I think it's not... It's clearly not just a regular summon mechanic, right? I think it's, I think it's just part of the fight, essentially. So I'm going to summon all of them. <laughs> Not that it's making a difference. I'm just getting... Alexander! Oh no, Okina? Horse, please. Wait, what's going on? Game? Come on, little squad running in there. The game completely messed up there. I don't know what happened. I need to try to get there now. Bloody Nora. Right, okay, go. Go, 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 go. My squad, they're on the case. 
Alexander! Am I dead? I don't want Alexander to die, though. It's not like they do any damage. <laughs> they aim for like 29, 36. I don't know what happened there. The game just kind of went crazy and sort of tapped me out. Very annoying. Uh, unfortunately, I have to go, but um, I don't think I'm going to bother with the summons. Uh, obviously, we'll pick this up in the next half. For you guys, that'll be in about four seconds. For me, it'll be probably tomorrow. It's very, very late. I'm very, very tired. I'm not ready to kind of <laughs> put my full force into a whole boss, but we've got half an hour left of the video, so I'm assuming we're going to kill Radan in this video, and I will edit until that happens. He's killed me three times already. I'm a little spooked. There was an interesting thing mentioned in the um, in the intro video for Radan. That guy up there, the uh, announcer dude, said that he was being eaten inside by <sighs> who's the scarlet rot of someone. That Miliqua person, I think it was. I can't remember. One of the members of that council from earlier. Does that mean he's resistant to Scarlet Rot, or does that mean he's weak to Scarlet Rot? Can I, like... Like, if he's being eaten from the inside by a Scarlet Rot, it's taking over his body, making him go mad, can I, like, add to that? Because I can poison my weapon with Scarlet Rot. We've got a few attempts at doing that. Not many, though. I think we've got one, actually. I think we literally have one attempt at doing that, don't we? Yeah, I have a single Rot Grease. So... I've got to remember to put raisins in my inventory. I'll do it now. Sweet, sweet raisins. Okay. We'll, we'll just have some normal attempts. Like, three attempts is not enough. We'll, we'll just bash our head against it for a while and see what happens. I can always go level up as well. We've got, like, quite a few souls in waiting. But uh, we'll give it a few tries. We'll see what happens. Yeah, I'll be, I'll be back in a bit. Right, folks. It's a brand new day, which means I'm either going to kill this guy in uh, one try... Or I'll die about a hundred times. <laughs> it's one of the two. I'm picking up where Mitchie knows immediately where we left off uh, in the first half of the video. I think I'm going to keep ignoring the summon signs, I think. I think we can do it without. I don't think we need it. I, I think, for now at least, I need to try to stick with my philosophy for as long as I can. I'm not sure it's always going to be viable. As I did say earlier in the game... Very purposefully, but uh, I think for now it is viable, so we're going to try to do it. Let's keep on doing this. Nope. Okay, hey, I dodged that for like the first time. Ah, not that time. Ah, ah! I was so proud of myself. It was also brief. Dummy. Hey, what? It does boost my maximum stamina, but not by much, it must be said. Oh, crap. Okay, come on, Radon, you big boy. Oh, he bled. He bled. He does bleed. Wait, where's he gone? Radon. Radon. Ah! Radon. Can't just casually turn into a meteor like it's not a big deal. What's going on here? I'm trying to build my stamina up as much as possible. Are those gonna fly at me or what's going on? They're just sitting there ominously. 
Which is much worse. Oh! I don't know how I dodged that. Right, I have to go in. I don't know what else to do. I dodge these first. Crap! Ah! Uh. Fun fact, I forgot how to mount for a second. I literally forgot which button you press to mount. Oh! Oh my god! They hit like a truck. I tried to time that better, I didn't. Ah! Suck it! <laughs> What did I say? Is that we're gonna be first try, or it was gonna take a million years? Woo! <laughs> I knew I had to save the horse. I had to get in some of my uh, left trigger attacks because they always hit hard. The stars are moving again. Okay. <clears throat> a little proud of myself. I'm aware that we probably outstart this and that it's typically a harder fight. Because like I said, we, we were probably meant to do Kaelid. Nothing there is there. <laughs> we were probably meant to do Kaelid earlier than we actually did. But, um... <laughs> I just think that's so funny. Because, like, usually the first time I try a boss is one of my better attempts, right? We've seen that quite a few times. I go in, I try once, it goes really well. And then things start to go really badly, and then eventually I kill it. That's that's how it's worked several times so far. And so I said it today in a sort of jokey way. I didn't really expect to kill him. Yeah, not bad for, what, fourth or fifth try or something? Hey, Alexander. You okay, buddy? Ah, hello there. Um, it was a battle marvellously fought. You are well and truly a champion, friend. I, on the other hand... I'm nothing but a crock. One hit was all it took to crack me, and for my insides to come spilling out. After that, I... I hid like a coward. And as such, I can hardly stand to face one such as you. I still like you. <sighs> but don't you think I've given up just yet? As luck would have it, there's a veritable mountain of warriors' bodies right here. If I can just squeeze this bunch down inside me, I'll be a mighty warrior again in no time. And you know, the bodies found here are exceedingly fine. Who could expect any less from the very warriors who fought in the Shattering? The greatest of all wars. Hm. Just you wait and see, friend. I'll grow even stronger. Just you wait when next we meet. <laughs> I really like Alexander, but I have pessimism about where his uh, story is going to go. The bodies found. Who could expect any less from the very warriors? Life, are you proud of me, buddy? The, greatest the stars are moving wars. again. I did it. I did it, Blythe. Ah, good. <clears throat> I'm waiting for you. Oh, what a sick way to fight, eh? The glory of the clash is shared by Radan and you. And <laughs> did you see that afterwards? A falling star right before our eyes. I can't fathom how Radan was holding back something of that scale. He was a living legend if ever I saw one. And the path has now been cleared. To Nokla, where Rani's fate will be decided. Let's meet where the falling star bit the earth. We'll take up our souls once more. For Mistress Rani. Let's meet where the falling star bit the earth. And we'll go into battle again. Side by side. My only purpose is to fight for Rani's fate, 
Sword and fan. The curtain's rising. On the final act. Let's meet where the fun will go into the <laughs> Um, is it marked right? Okay, wait, 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 wait. Let me see if I can figure it out. Where it was that way, right? So, what direction is that? Hey, maybe it was more like it could have been more. I'd have to go back and check the video. <clears throat> I'm wondering if it's back near here or back, it'll be back around here, right? No, it would be down here. Wait, no, it would be here. I've, I mean, the map's confusing me now. Mistwood is what I'm looking for. That's where we first got into Nocklon, remember? Through the well. So, the p the point, I'm assuming, is to go back into Nocklon, right? Is that it there? That could be it. Might check that out. Okay, well, I mean, f we're going to do Caleb first anyway. We've done this, but we've, we've got plenty of stuff left to do. Oh, this is where... Ah, okay. Right. Well then. Now, no, 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 no. Before we do any of that, let's head to the round table first of all, because we just killed Radan. That's a big deal. Um, I want to see what is in his soul. Might be a weird way to put things, but that's kind of what I mean. And I've heard things someone suggested to me. Talk to this it last. Be thousands upon thousands. All right, I got it. <laughs> Why do you hate me? So I just want to see. Yeah, what's this? Heavens forbid. Oh, I'm sorry. That is not the domain of mere men. I just wanted to ask. The burning of the art tree is the first cardinal sin. And you say you seek the power of the rune of death too? The rune of death goes by two names. The other is destined death. The forbidden shadow plucked from the golden order upon its creation. Uh, unleashing the rune now would be unthinkable. The fingers would never permit it. Nor would the greater will. Mm. But here we are. The fingers dormant, severing our link to the greater will. The realm and all life in ruins. Impossible events transpire beyond the ken of the fingers. Who is to say that the cardinal sin must be cardinal forever? Go on. Finish the job. Take the course you deem most worthy. Hmm. Anywho, what do we get? It's a colossal greatsword. It's an, why are they all intellect, man? All intellect weapons. It looks so cool. It looks so cool. <laughs> really, they're actually both the same. These two. Um, so yeah, I heard this this sword right here. So I don't care about the other thing. I'm gonna grab this. I might just grab this. I don't really care about the souls, do I? Let's just grab that. I don't really care about the bow, do I? Great bow of black iron wielded by General Radan, decorated with a lion mane motif, imbued with gravitational power of the Star Scourge. When used along with Radan's spear, it became a true weapon of a champion. Okay, cool. Wow. Okay, so. We talked about that weapon in the last video, right? This one here. Um, Morgoth's Cursed Sword. The thing he used to, to bash me. Um, it causes... So it needs arcane, right? Which is annoying, sure. However, however, there's something called power stancing, apparently, right? Where you use two two-hand weapons or two great swords or two colossal swords or whatever... And because this one causes blood loss, this and my blade here, in conjunction, should be really, 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 really good together. It's also an insane dex weapon, which is good because I'm heavy on the dex. What I'm going to do is I'm, I'm going to upgrade Morgoth's sword. And if we need to go to 17 dex, we're going to go to 17 dex. Because... Seven, not dex, arcane. Arcane, if we look at it... In our stats. Uh, help. Oh, 
Also affects Holy Defense, Vitality, certain sorceries and incantations. It doesn't say that, but Arcane actually contributes to bleed effects. Now, I don't know if that's just for spells and stuff, or if it counts for my weapon. But my weapon causes blood loss, in a way. And which is why that one's Arcane. I, 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 I've got a theory in mind. Well, I took you for I'm not dead! dead. <laughs> Please! We're gonna, we're gonna strengthen it, and we'll go from there, because I don't really... Well, yeah, I don't really care about using the stones, do I? Let's keep an eye on the scaling. E, C, D. 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 E, B, D. E, B, B. I really need tier eights. So, that is like a long-term possibility to start... Because both of them scale really well with decks. And we basically, we pick up both of these, we power stance with them, and we'd go full in on decks at that point. I'd probably knock my strength down, actually. Well, maybe strength for this is fine, but then it would all be decks from that point forward. I just think it's a cool idea. I think it sounds like a fun idea. So, we're going to level 10 points into Arcane. That's going to suck a little bit. Because at the end of the day, actually, tell you what we're going to do. Tell you what we're going to do. Okay, I thought like I could rest here. Oh, we can. Tell you what we're going to do. Because my concern is, I'm going to put points into Arcane. I'm, I'm essentially wasting 10 levels, where I don't necessarily get a lot stronger. So what we're going to do, it's it's time, folks. They've been sitting here for ages. It is time they were used. I'm going to pop every single soul we have and see where we end up. Because at the end of the day, I'm, I'm wasting levels by not using these, right? And we can't see it on the screen. Does it say my source? Oh, it does. I was hoping to avoid it. So that's going to pop absolutely everything. And see where we end up. I'm quite excited about the idea. <laughs> At the end of the day, I've been kind of gimping my character a little bit by not using these, right? It doesn't really make sense to not use them. Because what I might do is put points into Vitality along with Arcane. Just so I'm not spending 10... It means we'll have to level up 20 times instead. But I don't want to like necessarily gain 10 levels and not necessarily get stronger for it. I, although, if it turns out it doesn't really work, then we'll probably just respec anyway, right? Since we can do that once now. Wrong button. I'm very curious about these, these big boy runes when we get down there. These are still golden runes. That's 5 11s. 31,000. See, it's just not that much. There's no point holding on to these. This is 12s, 7.5k each, 13, 10k, then we're into the big boy runes, these are hero runes and then a lord's rune, so hero rune 1 is worth 15,000, hero rune 5 is worth 35,000 on its own, and hero and the lord's rune Okay. 50,000. Nice. So we gained about three. Well, we gained. We spent some, didn't we? So we probably gained about 250,000 souls. So what I'm going to do is. One, two, three, four, five. I feel like that's four levels. Five. We can put three into Arcane. Boost my discovery so we'll find more items. And every level boosts your defense power, at the very least, as you can see. Holy seems to. I seem to be getting stronger against Holy, and my immunity goes up really well, actually. That's interesting. Do they all do that? Oh, they all do that. Yeah? Yeah. One, two, three, and then the others are going into Vigor. Wait, what? I thought I could do five. It's only four? That's four. <laughs> Alright, we'll go like that. And we're going to go up to 50 Vigor, and 17 Arcane. Although, I think that Vigor only gave me 26 health. Hmm. <clears throat> okay. Cool. Um. Yeah. Yeah? Yeah, I'm pretty, I'm pretty happy with this as an idea. I, I like the idea, and maybe the Arcane will boost... Maybe we could even learn some basic incantations, you know? Doesn't have to be a big deal. Um... Maybe we've got something that's an arcane spell or something. I suppose I haven't been buying them, right? 
But maybe if we saw something that used arcane, that's that's got potential. I'll have to find an arcane wizard person. I don't really know. <laughs> I quite clearly don't really know. But um, we'll figure it out. It's okay. Right, back to Caleb. Not for long. Video's nearly over. I've got to remember that I've spent half an hour doing this already. Uh, I'm just going to head back here. I want to go explore, basically, zigzag all the way across here. All the way up to the northwest. There we go. No! <laughs> Stop it. <laughs> That was a fun fight. His intro video was the coolest video so far. And I get the feeling he once was this great warrior crossing the plains, destroying everyone. And uh, he got into a fight with Michaela? Melania? I can't remember. One of the bosses on that list, though. And she cursed him with the Scarlet Rot. One day, I'll be plus seven. <laughs> One magical day. I'm very... I mean, he bled quick. Wasn't that a bleed on the third hit? I'm very curious whether I will bleed things more if I put points in Arcane. I don't know for sure. Because it's freaking Elden Ring. <laughs> it's a Soulsborne game. God forbid they give me the information. <laughs> Sometimes it feels like you just figure things out through testing. Sometimes it feels like you do kind of have to go online a little bit, you know, and, and figure things out that way. Bird with teeth! <laughs> Ow. Dogs with teeth! Christ, I'm gonna die! What's going on? Things are brutal when you're not on horseback. Ah no! Torrent, I'm sorry! Jesus! <laughs> yeah. Okay, where's I going? Yeah, this way. Jesus. What are you? Why are you so spooky looking? Oh. Oh, okay. He's actually a... <laughs> he's actually like a proper dude. I'm gonna... He looks like a ringwraith. Look at his horse! Man, I really wish we had horse armor. I know that's like a Bethesda joke, but... Unironically... I think it'd be so cool to be able to put torrent and stuff like that, you know? To suit whatever type of character you're playing. Man, I'm killing the horse more than I'm killing him. Barely hit the guy. You're in trouble, buddy. Oh no, maybe. I oh, I did. Oh. Cheeky little lighter. Ash of War, Poison Moth Flight. It's interesting. There's a church up there. Set up there. Church is always cool. As I've said before. Bird with teeth! <laughs> Churches tend to have a grey site and they tend to have a sacred tier. Or they at least have an item of some description. Maybe they'll try to murder me. Who knows? The Cathedral of Dragon Communion. Okay. All the dragons have had their head removed. That's strange. Um. It's a rather spooky red thing over there. <laughs> well, when can I level up again? 
man. <clears throat> Ancient Dragon Apostles Cookbook. Oh, okay. I can spend dragon hearts. This is where I th this is where I spend those dragon hearts I've been collecting to learn spells. Transforms cast it into a dragon. Wow. Okay. I don't think that's for me right now. Maybe it is though. I don't know. No, I don't, I'm not. I'm not going for a magic build. I'm not. It's not. It's not the idea. Even if I end up taking what I'd like, what I was hoping from Arcane is that it wouldn't be like incantations or magical spells. I was hoping maybe for some utility abilities. You know, like the ability to cure poison and stuff like that. Right? That seems like an arcane kind of thing to do. All right, calm down. Who are you? Try to cure myself with raisins. That's how prones are doing. Man. Kaelid, do you ever calm down? <laughs> why have you always got to go this hard? Look at that skull, it's crazy. Okay, cool. Well, we got a new thing. Things are cool. There's a spooky looking building over there, so that's cool. Let's head over there. What's down there? Is that the swamp? We are going to go there, because we need to find the Golden Needle, remember? I do regret... There's something I wish I'd done from the very start of this game, and I saw recommendations from, like, pre-release reviews. Oh, that's a dragon. To war! The King Akizix. You are so cool! What do we do when it flies? We run away! We run away more than that. Am I okay back here? Oh, maybe I'm not. Oh, that's a lot of rot. Ugh. Okay, we're okay, we're okay. No, so close. I don't know if it's, I mean, there's no way for me to know for sure, but I've bled this guy twice already. It does feel like it's happening a lot. Run away. I have the high ground. <laughs> somehow, <laughs> against the dragon. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. Can I run this? Yeah. Time for you to, to decay for real, my friend. Uh, hit him in the face. And again, yeah. Bounce. And another dragon heart. A new draconic power available. That's interesting because this is late game. So what if you wanted, like, if you you could even do a late game build, where you just go full on dragon mode. I guess I don't know if it's viable or whatever, but it's more to life than viability. It's weird, I don't often say that. <laughs> I'm all about the min-maxing of items. I just want to double check there's no items around here. There's the church. Um. Okay. There's a grayside down here. So we're going to go grab that. 
think I saw a gravesite. Yeah, there it is. And then, um, I guess we'll explore more in the next video. It's been a successful day. I felt good today, you know. I felt good. I felt sexy. And it worked. Let's find out where we are. As per usual, we are in the Kaled Highway South. Okay. Right, we are going to end it there. Thank you very much for joining me, ladies and gentlemen. Uh, took down Radon. We'll be back very soon. I'm going to carry on playing right now. And Oh, no, wait, 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 wait. We got a new physic ages ago. What was it? Was it one of these ones? Oh, I think so. Enhances dodge rolls. That's interesting. Anyways, thanks for joining me. Cheers, much as always. Bye-bye.